All right. Thank you, everybody. Next up, Columbus Crew Forward. Cucho, Recording in progress. Open up to questions in the room. Buenas tardes. Good afternoon. Any questions? Juan, first and foremost, welcome to Pachuca. And there are many compatriots of yours, Colombians, who have become very famous. What have you spoken to, perhaps, regarding Marino, and what have you researched, and what are your first impressions? Hi, good afternoon. Well, in recent weeks, of course, I've been paying a lot of attention to Pachuca. They've had no competition recently, and uh, Nelson de Osa is there from Atlético Nacional. I've faced off against Salomon in England. This is a very intense team. It goes without saying. They cover the entire field. They run a lot. We have to be paying close attention to everything they might do. And we're looking forward to the win. Now, uh, there's been a lot of talk about the altitude. You guys have been working to make up for that factor. Do you think it might play a role in a match as important as this? No, I think we're very ready for any kind of match. Our club has given us certain tools to better prepare, but we just faced Tigres at their home, and Rayados again as well, and we were able to win. And it was very hot when we played Monterey. These are things you have to play with, and I think physically we're prepared, so hopefully it will not play to Pachuca's advantage tomorrow. Hey, Cucho. You've had significant experience, European football, MLS championships. How do you approach a final like this as a team? What do you tell fellow players on the team who maybe don't have the experience you do? Well, we're all excited. I'm just as excited as the player who's only played five or six matches. There's no need to motivate. I think we're going to be playing the most important final on this continent, which will give us a ticket to play for the wor in the world in the club's World Cup. If you're not excited by that, then you weren't born for football. So we're just very excited and all ready for tomorrow. Now, Cucho, how did you prepare individually, personally, to be ready physically? As you prepare for this face-off against Pachuca. I am happy to be available for this match. I don't know if I'll be able to play, but I'll be available, ready to help the team at any time, and that's very gratifying. Hey, Cucho. The Mexican press has said that your team has been the executioner of the greats. Now, do you think that Pachuca, given its long, successful trajectory, may be the next one on the hit list? That's a hard question to answer. I am familiar, but not that much of what every club has to offer here in Mexico. Now, of course, when you hear about Tigres, Rayados, Pachuca, América, etc., these are great teams. We don't think and it'll be any easier or harder. We think this will be a match where you go and it's 50-50 and may the best team win. But our mentality and the way we compete is striving for the win, but with great respect for the opponent. Now, talking about differences in Mexico, some believe that Liga MX is far superior to the MLS. What do you think about that? How would you rate Liga MX considering your experience in South America and in the rest of the continent? Well, I think it's more a debate among fans and the press. No offense. 
I've never stopped to think uh, if the MLS is superior to the Liga MX or vice versa. Now we have a final, MLS versus Liga MX, US versus Mexico, and that always adds a bit of spice to things. But we're representing the country, the league, and we want to give our all. And we have faced off against teams with great players. And the level of play here in Me Mexico is great. And I really like to watch Mexican football. Hi, Kucho. Um, real quick, you said... Um, Obviously, you're available. You want to be available for this match. Can you talk about about training this week and why you feel like you're able to be available coming off that injury? Bueno, si creo que te entendí es que como me well, if I understood correctly, you asked how do you how I feel about being available, right? Ask your question once again, please. Hi, Kujo. Um, you mentioned that you're obviously available for tomorrow. Can you talk about getting back into training and why you feel ready to be available for this match? Right. Okay, well, like I said, I feel very happy to be available. It's something that I had in mind in recent weeks. I was a bit fearful of not being available, but I'm here, and I'm very happy about it. And I want to be here. I've gotten a lot better. So I just want to get rest today and be ready for tomorrow.